Hi, welcome to Tea in STEM with your favorite host, Gabrielle. Today, we journeyed into the streets of Jamaica where we spoke with different persons just to get some idea of science, technology, engineering, and math information and see how much they really know about what's going on. Let's go. Um, excuse me, miss. Hi, welcome to Tea in STEM. Can I have your name? Shauna. Hi, Shauna. All right, so I'm just going to ask you two questions, all right? So, do you know what the acronym STEM stands for? Yeah, science, technology, <laughs> uh, engineering, and math. Great. All right. Thank you. All right. So, I have one final question for you. Um, can you list a endemic only found in Jamaica? You can choose between the Jamaica swallowtail butterfly, um, Jamaica boa. All right, thank you so much. All right. All right, so today we're here with. All right, so I'm just gonna ask you guys two questions, and you let me know if you know the answer. All right, so what is? Can you name an endemic species of the Jamaica? That means the species only found in Jamaica. Um, mongrel and cat. <laughs> Can you define climate change and tell me two things that are affecting climate change? Um, greenhouse gases. Okay. Climate change. Yeah. Um, climate change is um, the changing of the atmosphere. Climate like yeah. we're, we're going like from hot to hot, 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. But what's causing the sea level to rise? The ice caps melt. Today, okay. we're here with? Sky. Yeah. Okay. So the first question is, do you know of any STEM-related programs in Jamaica? And if yes, can you name one? <laughs> no? Alright. Second question. Can you name an endemic species? That means a species only found in Jamaica. Welcome to Tea in STEM. Can I have your name? Uh, my name is Muhtotak Paira. Okay, so I'm going to ask you a few questions, okay? Okay. So the first question is, what does the acronym STEM stand for? STEM? Mm-hmm. I don't know. <laughs> okay, final question. Which Jamaican organization is leading efforts to restore coral reefs using the coral gardening technique? Uh, yeah, I know that. Uh, University of West Indies Marine Lab. Thank you. Boy, we reach far. But let's say people know and them don't know. Join us in our next episode where we'll discuss the responses from each and every participant and also have our very first guest speaker across the island. Journey with me to our next episode. Bye.